Hey, what's going on, Salt Strong Nation? Richard here. So back out here again today and uh man another cold and windy one but hey we're gonna be fishing uh some areas guys today that are gonna be tidal creeks as in like i'm only gonna be able to get in there for a little while uh before the water all comes out and it's gonna be pretty much dry so only got a few hours to fish but usually in these type of areas when you can find the fish they're very very likely to eat because they know they've only got a certain amount of time um, and that's why they're up here you know to feed quickly and then head back out with the tide so i'm gonna go ahead and get after it guys but i'm gonna be throwing a couple things a day probably the 2.0 and then the power prawn junior that's been working really really well lately especially in this colder water just bumping that on the bottom has really been good and uh, really successful for me so i'll go ahead and see you out there There we go, got another one. <laughs> Right. nice trout guys <laughs> right at the boat i knew that was going to happen as soon as i went for the net man did not get a good hook set on him thought it was a red so i set pretty hard uh well power prawn jr is doing it guys that was a really nice trout <laughs> all right guys not a good day for camera work my uh, battery died as soon as i hooked up with this red but just starting to get him in now got a new battery in here Still pretty fired up but same thing guys just throw in right at these drains uh, that are coming off of these flats all right that right there on the power prime junior <laughs> he about got off barely hooked there beautiful little red just give him a good release all right a little bit of slap good deal <laughs> All right, guys, so I want to show you real quick just kind of the tactics that I'm using in one of these tidal creeks. And you can do this any, you know, tidal creek that's in your area as well. But, you know, basically the concept of just what I'm doing is I'm setting up kind of right here. I'll show you in a second where the current is coming at me and I'm facing the current. I've got my stigget pin in right now and I'm just basically, you know, on a really good area, kind of a choke point. Um, and really the best type of areas in these tidal creeks that I usually try to fish are going to be the bends in the creeks usually there's a little bit more water in those and if you can kind of multiply that so to speak with a drain or something like that that's pouring out into one of these uh, deeper holes that's really really good and it's typically going to hold some more fish so I'm going to turn you guys around real quick and kind of show you exactly what I'm talking about so all right so as you can see right here guys basically where I'm at, I've got a nice, you know, hole right out here in front of me. And then right there, you can see there's a little bit of a drain coming off all kind of in this area and right there as well. So these two spots are drains and there's flats further on. And what's happening is all of that bait and stuff's getting washed out and straight into this hole. And so far I've caught a really nice red and hooked up with a, a nice trout and he got off unfortunately. But that's generally the type of tactic that I'm using today. And I'm just going to each one of these and anytime I see a good hole that's got one of these drains on it, like over here, I'm gonna park and I'm just gonna cast up current and kind of let my lure, you know, drift back with the current and see what fish are in there. There we go. Yep, that's good fish. All right. Oh, he's coming right back at me. Oh, that's a good red, guys. Woo! <laughs> All right. Man, look at this guy. 
Woo, man. Power Prawn Junior guys is bumping on the bottom. It's targeting little drains. Oh, he's still got some fight in him. All right. Man, look at this guy. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Get in here. Woo, we've got some fight. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely going to need the net for him. Oop, don't go under there. Come on. Man, this guy is fired up. Look at his rod, guys. <laughs> he is working it. Man. He's trying to get into this grass and structure. Come on. There. Look at that. Power Prawn Junior, guys. All right. <laughs> Woo. All right. Beautiful fish. Check out the spots on him. Super cool. Right here on the Power Prawn Junior, guys. All right, guys, so I wanted to show you real quick what I was using today to catch those redfish and trout. You saw it was super effective, and this one of my favorite ways to fish uh, this type of presentation, which is really just gonna be a shrimp imitation. So, guys, I love this power prawn right here, and I love rigging it weedless, just like this, on a 1 8 ounce weedless hook. And I've just got this paired up with 20 pound Andy monofilament, nothing crazy, uh, with a loop knot. That way you've got some really, really good action. And if you guys could see in that catch footage what I was doing was basically throwing up current and I was letting this drift back and then really kind of giving it a little bit of slack just enough where it would get to that bottom and it would just naturally kind of go back with the current um, and that was just a great presentation today and it was awesome and it worked out really really well so I just wanted to show this to you guys um, and one other thing that I always add as well is going to be Dr. Juice and an extra little added benefit you know if you can put a little rattle in here these new power prawn usas are awesome you can put in a rattle no problem and just stick it in there we have these battle rattles in our shop that helps especially when you're in high current areas and situations like that a little bit extra noise is not going to hurt you know it really just helps get your bait noticed because there's so much bait in the water right now so any advantage right now that you can get will definitely be worth it this time of year and if you're new to Salt Strong, just know that we're the best online club for saltwater anglers, especially if you're targeting redfish, sea trout, snook, or flounder. There's nothing else like it, and we actually guarantee that you'll catch more fish while saving time and money. We do this with our premium education, the exclusive insider community, and huge discounts on all the tackle you need. To learn more, go to saltstrong.com. Otherwise, we hope to see you again soon.